be unto you in peace from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. I was glad when they said to me, let us go into the house of the Lord. And I'm Father Steve Sellers, and thank you so much for tuning in today for this brief daily message of hope. And my prayer for you today is that you are finding hope in your world today. And there is hope out there because God is out there. And there's hope with you because God is with you. And I just want to talk briefly today because I've got some uh, major things happening in my world right now uh, that I'm going to tell you about. But I want to talk briefly about what happens when things seem to be totally out of control. <laughs> what do we do when things are out of control? Uh, where do we turn? And of course, the answer to that is we turn to the Lord. Nothing is out of control in the hands of the Lord. Uh, when things seem to be uh, hurtling off into a, a tailspin in our lives, we know that God is not hurtling there with us. He's holding us in the midst of that. Uh, I tell people who feel like they're sinking down in the world that uh, they may be going down, but God is holding them as they're going down because the Lord is with us no matter what's going on in our lives. Uh, even in the midst of uncertainty. And I'm facing some uncertainty right now. I'm playing my guitar today. I may not be able to play it for quite some time uh, now, and I may not be able to play the piano for quite some time. I'm going to continue to try to do my daily broadcasts, but I'm not sure how those are going to come out because I have torn the rotator cuff in my right shoulder right up here and maybe done some damage to the biceps and the, the, the tendon that's uh, up in my right shoulder. So I'm having surgery tomorrow morning, uh, very, very early tomorrow, to repair a torn rotator cuff. Uh, the irony in all of this is that I, I did, for 20 years of my life, do the most violent thing you can do to your shoulder. I threw a baseball over and over and over, hundreds of thousands of times probably, uh, competitively, uh, until I was 25 years old. I played uh, baseball through uh, high school and through college and grad school and through a, a summer of semi-pro ball, throwing a, vi a baseball violently with my right hand in the shoulder. And none of, my, none of it uh, damaged me where I, <laughs> I was going to have to have surgery until just a few days ago when I tore the cartilage, tore the rotator cuff as I was pulling down the rear door, the rear hatch, on my SUV and I knew immediately what I'd done and so it's quite painful now and the surgery tomorrow morning is going to leave me in a sling in my right arm for probably 12 weeks. I'm not sure what's going to happen to my piano playing or my guitar playing or anything else. So I'm facing big uncertainty. So what do we do when we feel like things are spiraling out of our control? Well, we know that God is holding on to us as we spiral out of control. And from God's perspective, it's not out of control. So what I'm choosing to do now in the midst of all this uncertainty, and I know there's going to be pain that goes with it because I've, I've sat with a lot of people as they've had rotator cuff surgery or several people. And, uh, and I know what's facing me tomorrow morning, but you know what? I just choose to believe that I'm not going into that all by myself. No, I'm in the hands of the Lord and I'm placing myself firmly in his hands, in his grasp. Uh, so I know he's going there with me. He'll accompany me no matter what happens. And so whether, you know, as a, we, we say in the burial office, you know, uh, if we live, we live unto the Lord. If we die, we die unto the Lord. Whether we live, therefore, or die, we are the Lord's. Those are the words of St. Paul from Romans. We are the Lord's. And I place myself in his hands. And I hope I can uh, continue to play music for you as we uh, get back into this tomorrow. And I hope I can even do this again tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Um, but I know that it's uh, God's, uh, God's will and because he's uh, with me and that he is uh, walking with me and carrying me through that. So when you feel as though your life is spiraling downward, you're in the hands of the Lord. Place yourselves firmly in his hands and know that he's got a hold of you. Even if we can't grasp back, if we're not able to, he's got a hold of us and he's not going to let go. So God bless you today. Uh, and I hope through his grace and mercy, I will see you again here tomorrow in some form or fashion. 
uh, will continue to, to bring a word of hope into the world. And please know that during my recovery period, which is going to be six to nine months long, uh, I'm going to be speaking these words of hope to myself <laughs> as well as to you. Uh, because there is hope in the world, because God is in the world, there's hope with you and with me, because, because God is with you and with me right there with us. God bless you, and I hope to see you again tomorrow. God bless you.